The saga is over. Four-star quarterback Jaden Rashada commits to Arizona State. Kind of came out of the blue, Gorney. We had been hearing it might happen. It turns out he makes it official. And uh, this is where his dad went to school. But And they made a push once he became available. It's still a little bit surprising with the timing. Yeah, after everything fell apart at Florida with the NIL deal, he kind of came back onto the market, got out of his letter of intent, and Arizona State and TCU became the top two schools for him. He visited both. But in the last couple of days, it seemed like TCU had sort of fallen off. Arizona State was confident, but not completely certain um, on on the situation, uh, you know, especially since he had gone through his recruitment. And there have been some unpredictable moments along the way uh, to be nice. But this is huge for the Sun Devils. He, it adds another quarterback to the room, one that's unexpected and a kid that has a lot of talent. He wasn't great at the Under Armour game, uh, but you could you could tell the arm talent is there. Um, you know, Kenny Dillingham getting him in the room will be important. They added Drew Pine and Jacob Conover from uh, Notre Dame and BYU, respectively, in the portal. This adds to that quarterback room, and he has the ability to compete with those guys to get on the field early. So a nice addition for Dillingham early in his tenure at Arizona State, and and one that's you know was almost completely unexpected just a few weeks ago. Yeah, the the fit it, it came together quickly, but we've seen Dillingham, you know, kind of work wonders. I mean, uh, at his past few stops, especially with a guy like Bo Nix, who he kind of completely reinvented at Oregon. Do you think uh, maybe even if he has to sit a year, it could be beneficial for Rashada uh, there at Arizona State? Yeah, I think the thing to watch here is that Jaden Rashada is patient and is willing to sit a year. I think you know, learning in the system, kind of getting to Tempe and getting his feet on the ground, and now recruiting is over. Um, you know, he didn't come off as a kid that was going to go through this wild recruitment with a with a big-time NIL issue. Um, and so I think once he gets there, once Dillingham gets him into the playbook, once all of that kind of comes together, um, he should be absolutely fine at Arizona State and a really nice addition for those guys. Don't forget, like, the reason Dante Moore was going to Oregon almost completely was because Kenny Dillingham was there. He recruited incredibly well there. He recruited inc incredibly well at Florida State when he was there. And now at Arizona State, um, you know, he's gotten one of the top, you know, handful of quarterbacks in the country, top 10 quarterback in the country, and Jaden Rashada to come out there and to turn down essentially a team that was playing for the national championship just a few weeks ago. So this is a nice addition. Um, if Jaden Rashada is willing to go there and learn and be patient, it could be a, a very nice uh, boost to that quarterback room down the road. All right, so Arizona State shoots up the team rankings after Dillingham's hiring as they continue to rebuild the program, and they finish it off with four-star quarterback Jaden Rashada. Thanks, Corny.